Did you know that analysts believe the split will cause the price of Tesla stock to skyrocket? Some well-known Tesla bears predict that throughout the split, the EV company stock price would hover around $200. On the other hand, some predict that Tesla's stock will surge immediately following the split by year's end. To learn more about this, stay watching and tuning in. The views of Tesla bulls and bears are never in agreement. Bears have forecast incredibly low prices for the same stock, while bulls have seemingly impossibly high valuations for the company's equities. It's difficult to tell in the current economy whether Tesla is headed for a higher or lower valuation. You'll learn why Tesla stock will soar following the split in today's video. The closing price of Tesla's shares on August 24th was around $891. Shares were trading at about $302 when the market started for business the following morning at 9.30 a.m. As the company's three-for-one stock split went into effect on the 24th, shares of Tesla, the maker of electric vehicles, surged in after hours trading. This is the second such move in around two years as the most valuable automaker in the world attempts to lower the price of its stock. Following the market's closure on August 24th, Tesla stock started trading on a split-adjusted basis. As a result of the most recent stock split, which was authorized by shareholders earlier this month, each investor gained nearly two extra shares. In an effort to lower the price of the almost $900 stock, Tesla initially revealed the proposed three-for-one stock split in June. The new share price, based on the closing price of today, would be somewhat less than $300 per share. Since announcing the three-for-one split in early June, Tesla's shares have increased by about 25%. However, in the 20 days that followed the announcement, shares of Tesla increased by almost 70% due to news of a 5-1 stock split that occurred about two years previously, Stock splits are often well-liked by shareholders. At least having the impression that you're getting something for nothing is good. However, stock split does not always indicate that investors are receiving a better return on their investment. A stock split facilitates minor trades for individual investors, but has no effect on the company's fundamentals. A lot of experts predict that the Tesla split will lower the price of the company's stock for individual investors, but even with the three-to-one proposal approved, Tesla's stock has lost more than 28% of its value so far this year. This is essentially consistent with the overall market, and Tesla is currently listed on the NASDAQ Composite Index, which is down 20% so far this year. Since Tesla's stock price has been close to $1,000 per share for some time, most regular investors have found the company to be prohibitively expensive. The three-for-one stock split, according to Lindsay Bell, Alley's chief money and market strategist, should change all of that and encourage more retail participation in the business. A portion of the company is more easily affordable for regular investors when equities are trading in what is known as a comfortable range. This increases interest in the shares and increased interest in the stock results in additional traders. But on August 25th, the world's most valuable automaker announced a three-for-one stock split to attract individual investors. And as a result, Tesla shares closed 2% lower, with the split allowing investors to receive two additional shares for each share they had as of August 17th. The stock opened at $300-302 and closed at $296.07. It closed at $891.29 prior to the division. Stock splits, according to B. Riley, chief market strategist at Art Hogan, are undoubtedly more appealing to ordinary investors and also result in more cheap options. What does Tesla stand to gain from the stock split? A stock split usually indicates optimism inside the organization. Additionally, it expresses confidence that the share price will eventually rise to a level that is comparable to or higher than its pre-split level. Such an idea is supported by the performance of Tesla shares recently. Tesla's stock has soared over the last month as of Tuesday morning's early trade. It had up more than 6%. Before experiencing a decline during the last week, the stock had increased by almost 13% since one month ago. The EV company released mixed second quarter numbers, indicating a nearly one-third drop in profit from the prior three months. This decline was partly caused by production slowdowns at a Shanghai factory during COVID lockdowns. Tesla's revenue increased by 42% and its profit doubled from the same quarter last year indicating significant long-term growth. Nevertheless, the company's stock has had a challenging year overall in 2022, declining by more than 18% since the start of the year. That decline is consistent with the sharp decline seen in all three of the major stock indices this year. So, nevertheless, in spite of these challenges, a large number of septics and frequent criticism for its conduct, Tesla has grown to become the world's most successful producer of electric cars. 
both the automaker and its share price have experienced remarkable growth. How do you feel about the current price of Tesla stock? Tell us in the space provided for comments below. The share. Price is expected to rise further after the split is completed for the reasons listed below first. Increased production leads to more car deliveries. It is commonly known that due to production limitations, Tesla has previously had trouble keeping up with demand for its cars. In actuality, the company's rapid expansion has been impeded by a shortage of production space. With the launch of two brand new gigafactories in Austin, Texas and Berlin, Germany, that is set to change. With the two new additions, Tesla hopes to increase its annual car production from 1.05 million to 2 million. Regrettably, the company continues to face the same problems that other automakers are currently having with their supply chains for components like electronics and raw materials. Second, a larger gross margin is the result of more. Deliveries. Simply said, a company's revenue less its cost of products is its gross profit margin. For Tesla, the car's MSRP less the direct cost of manufacturing would be the car's automotive gross margin. It would not include expenses for marketing or money spent on research and development, but it would include costs like the basic materials needed to produce each car. Those are the costs of operation. Due to a phenomena called scale, Tesla's gross margin rises as it produces more vehicles. Tesla would lose money if it constructed a factory with the capacity to make 500,000 cars, but only produce 50,000 as it would be paying for the additional capacity without really using it. Its fixed expenses are as low as possible as a percentage of its revenue when it produces all 500,000 cars, increasing its gross margin. Due to the company's record-breaking car deliveries, Tesla's gross margin has steadily increased and is currently at its highest point in the history of the business. Third, higher net income is correlated with a bigger gross margin. Most investors keep a close eye on net income. It's the company's profit margin, to put it simply. It's significant because it converts to earnings per share when divided by the total number of shares in circulation. Many analysts projected that Tesla would never turn a profit due to the high cost and difficulty of manufacturing automobiles. Only about 15% of the finest automakers, like Ford, are able to maintain a gross profit margin. However, Tesla has created industry-leading procedures for manufacturing electric cars, and the end product's quality justifies premium pricing. With a gross margin of 32.9%, Tesla has much more flexibility for operating investments, such as the creation of novel software technologies like autonomous driving and the design of new goods, which can help the business stay ahead of its rivals, more significantly, though, is that the large margin increases the amount of money going to the bottom line. Tesla's net income during the first quarter of 2022 was over $3.3 billion. Finally, it can be said that while the lower price per share may encourage new smaller investors to join the fold, the stock split of Tesla will not increase value for investors. The factors that will keep the company's shares rising both before and after the split are its steady profitability and quick growth in manufacturing capacity. In actuality, it is not anticipated that the stock split will have a long-term effect on Tesla shares. Tesla's stock split is a sensible move given the current share price, but it may not make a significant difference to its performance. Over the long term, stated Craig Earlham, senior market analyst at Awanda in New York in an interview, the majority of interest will not be swayed by the decision. However, smaller investors and Tesla staff may be pleased with the change. Earlham continued, while the dominance of institutional investors will limit individual participation, the split was designed to benefit employees while putting an eye on the retail segment. In the first quarter, Tesla's overall sales increased by 81% year over year to $18.8 billion, while its operating income increased to $3.6 billion. However, the company's Shanghai plant shutdown caused the second quarter figures to decline. Tesla ended the second quarter with the largest vehicle production month in history, an operating margin of 14.6 and positive free cash flow of $621 million despite the second quarter slowdown. In October, the business plans to disclose its third quarter revenue, output, and delivery figures. For more of this stuff, check out Tesla stock and our other films.